All right. This is it. I believe the NRA and Republicans in Congress should stop insulting people who want gun control and to end gun violence. The NRA and the Republicans' argument is movies and video games are the cause of violence. Game players, do, do you think um, that it's a slap in your face? Because uh, movies, maybe some violent movies like Quentin Tarantino's Django Unchained, they show violence. They show the effects of violence and video games. I believe some gamers know the difference between fantasy and real life. When you play a video game and if you get shot and killed, you come back from it. If you get shot with a real gun, either one or two possibilities. You might survive and count your lucky stars, or you're dead. You're never going to come back from gun violence. And the NRA and um, Republicans in Congress is passing the buck on that. Quit insulting us, uh, you two. Because um, you want people to have automatic weapons instead of shotguns. Shotguns, handguns, legal, or automatic weapons. Is that the new penis and vagina because you're not man or woman enough of, of, of having an automatic weapon with large caliber magazines oh uh, I'm going to play with my automatic weapon oh 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 I'm getting a heart on Jeez. Come on, folks. Damn it. Jeez. And violence. I made a video that I abruptly took down because I was uh, afraid that it could inspire violence. Hypothetical massacres. Because there's violence everywhere, people. A movie theater, mall, school shootings, and there's two possible places that violence could uh, uh, occur. One of them is in an NRA convention. Okay, Wing Love Pierre, y you. You, you're against gun violence. Wait a minute, let me change it. You're against, say, amendments for gun control. Here's my question. What if a mentally disturbed psychopath comes to an NRA convention and has some guns on, on them or steal guns off say, display uh, uh, areas. Use, use the gun and start shoot up the NRA convention. How would you like that now, bat buddy? And Congress in Washington, D.C., the ones who are favoring 
not having gun control. The same thing uh, applies. What is some psychopath comes in in your Congress meetings carrying a semi-automatic gun and shoots up the place? Will you pull out your gun? Or you duck, run, or hide, avoid being shot by a mentally disturbed psychopath? Then will you favor gun control and quit insulting us, huh? You might think it won't happen. Here's the old saying, never say never, folks. Because there's violence everywhere in, within the United States. And I believe shotguns or regular handguns are legal. And semi-automatic weapons, keep them in the hands of the military only. Or um, retirees from the military. They're the ones who should have the weapons and keep them hands out of the in individuals and the mentally disturbed they should not have those weapons in, in the first place and and there's some money that should be restored to the um, mental health to try to get these people cured and not having guns in their hands. And please quit insulting us about movies and video games all together. And are you going to try to ban, say, Nerf guns too? Because they shoot, uh, say, darts and pretend bullets. Because they don't hurt people like the real bullets. Because pretend bullets and darts do not pierce the skin. Bullets do. And bullets hurt and damage, okay? Quit insulting us all together. Congress, the Republicans. If you do, November 4th, 2014 will come uh, around and your asses will be voted out. Now that's the insult. I'm going to conclude with this. The name is Roy Toomey, also known as R. Toomey 1966. Broadcasting from my Acer computer from Dagsboro, Delaware. Time is 11.04 Eastern Standard Time in the morning. Today is the final day of January uh, 31st, 2013. I'm going to leave you with one final M message. If you don't pass con Gun Control Congress... And you keep insulting us about video games and movies. We're going to insult you back. Your asses are going to be voted out. On November 4th, 2014. Don't you dare say it won't happen. It will. Peace, bitches.